Hi everyone, welcome back to PBW channel. Our subject for today is health for P1 students. We are still in the unit 3 which is strength and self-esteem and our topic is about the differences between boys and girls. Last time, we already discussed about these differences about boys and girls. So let's have a review. In number one, for the boys or males, they usually have a bigger body than girls. Number two, they have a short hair. Number three, they have louder tone of voice. And number four, they are wearing pants. Now let's go with girls. Number one, they usually have a smaller body than boys. The second one is, they have softer and longer hair. The third one, they have soft and clear voice. Number four, they are wearing skirts. Number five, they wear accessories such as bracelets and hair clips. For the boys' emotions, the first one is being angry when getting scolded by their parents. Number two, they need praise from teachers or other adults. For example, they want to hear very good, good, great job. And number three, they always want to win or they always want to be number one. Now for the girls emotions we have, the first is be more sensitive than boys. So they cry easily. Number two, be calm and patient. Number three is be gentle and rarely show anger. Now here are the different characteristics for boys. Number one is they are more competitive. They always want to be the champion. The second one is they end their sentences with cup. Number three, they like to play sports that require a lot of energy such as football and climbing. They also want to play basketball. So these are boys like physical activities. Now here are the characteristics for girls. The first one is be more patient and careful. Number two, they end their sentences with ka. The third one is they like activities that require less energy, such as playing with dolls. And also, girls like to talk too much. So this time, or last time, we have answered page 49 on your book. So you need to put a check next to the correct answers. So the first box saying that boys should say cup. So it is correct. The second one, girls wear skirts. Yes. The third one, boys have a louder voice. The fourth one, boys like to play with dolls. 
it is not correct because girls like to play with dolls. Number five, most boys like sport. For example, basketball, soccer, or physical activities. So here are the four correct answers in number one on page 49. Have you got these four correct answers? Next, number two is put the letters next to the phrases into the blanks to show the differences between boys and girls. Now in letter A, they were skirts. Is it boys or girls? So the answer here is letter A for girls because girls are wearing skirts. Now letter B, who have a high tone of voice? Girls have high tone of voice while boys have louder tone of voice. Letter C, they are wearing pants. So these are for boys. Letter D, they have long hair. Girls. Letter E, they have short hair. Boys. Letter F, they end sentences with cup. Letter G, they end sentences with ka. Letter H, they like to play with dolls. Letter I, they like to play sports that require energy. So for boys. And the last one is, they are strong. Letter J is for boys. on page 51 and you need to answer this one this time. You are a girl. You need to draw a picture of a boy who is your friend in this box. Again, if you are a girl, draw a boy. For example, and then you write the name of your friend. For example, the name of your friend is Chan Yu. And then how is he or she different from you? So he has short hair, short hair. Another example is he is wearing pants. So write only one answer. Next, this time, if you are a boy, you need to draw a girl who is your friend. For example, your friend girl, and then you need to write her name. So your friend's name is, for example, the name of your girlfriend is Jen. And then how is she different from you? So she has a long hair, have a long hair, or wearing skirts. So just like for boys, write only one answer. Again, if you are a girl, draw a boy that is your friend. If you are a boy, you draw only a girl that is your friend and answer these two questions. Now, in number four, you need to put a check in the circle next to the answers that summarizes the differences between boys and girls. So, the first one here is, boys and girls are different in both physical appearance, your body, and personality. Next. Boys and girls are different in physical appearance, but their personalities are similar or the same. 
So the second one is not correct because the first one is the correct answer. So that ends for the lesson for this time, and I hope you understand the lesson. Thank you everyone for listening.